What's going on, Lawn Bros? Eddie here with Brown Brothers Lawn Care. I changed it up this time. I normally say, what's up, guys? What's going on, guys? Something to that effect. I want to start calling you guys something. Lawn Bros is what I've come up with. I've got that idea from somebody. Now, let me know what you think of that idea, Lawn Bros. Do you guys like call being called Lawn Bros? The story behind that is, well, I'm, my brother and I run the business, so uh, anybody I meet, I'm going to call him a lawn brother, like GIE Expo, call him a lawn brother, because we're all in the same industry, we're all doing the same work, doing, trying to reach the same goals, so I'd just call you a brother because we're helping each other out like brothers, like my brother and I, we work together, well I can work together with you guys here on this YouTube channel, and I answer any questions like a brother to you guys, and you guys feel free to comment down below any questions, I always respond to my comments, I always like them, I always check them out, I make sure to reply, make it a priority to make time for you guys. Today, we are actually pretty much responding to a comment and somebody wanted to know what size is the trailer. I responded to them, I always get questions about this in my Instagram, so I figured might as well just make a video on it. What size of trailer works best for you? So right now, I'm rocking with the six and a half by 12, and that seems to be perfect, but I would like to go bigger to a tandem axle trailer. Now, tandem axles start at about 16-foot trailers. Now, if you're just getting into the lawn care industry, what that's what I want to give this video to. What size of trailer do you need to just get in? Now, people will say, oh, just get a 5x8. That way you get one mower on there. Well, a 5x8 is about $850 brand new, where the 6x10 or a 5x10 is just a couple hundred dollars more at around 1000 now, yeah, you're saving $200, but you're going to have to sell that trailer and then get a 10-foot trailer and when you want to put two mowers on that trailer. So I would start with the 10-foot or even start with the 65 by 12 because I can get three mowers on there and I'm just fine. All, all sideways standards. And that's a 52, 48, 36. Now, if you started with the 5 by 10 like I did, I started with the 5 by 10 I was not able to put two standards on any which way. It was too small. Now, I would advise a 12-foot trailer for your starting. You want something you can grow into. Now, I'm going to want to go sell that trailer and bring in a 16-footer. That way I can easily fit three on there straight up, straight up and down. Because I am overweight with my 12-foot, but it's not that much to where I need to do it right now. But I do know as the future of the company, it, it's going to be worth it to get a 16 foot tandem axle which will also be just less stress on the trailer and be be a lot easier to get on and off the trailer with the mowers but I hope this video is it's gonna help you make a decision on you you gotta look at your 15 year outlook on your company not 15 but 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 five let's let's go small numbers five years you're gonna be a bigger company from the day you start you're the next day you're gonna be bigger okay but let's take it years years at a time you're gonna need that 16 footer you're gonna need the 12 footer first you're gonna need the 16 footer after a couple years or even after your first year like basically that's what I'm doing after my first year I need a 16 foot trailer Be because you're gonna grow you this is such a profitable business that you're gonna grow fast and your equipment's gonna be outdated within a year you're gonna need new equipment new uh, handhelds new mowers more mowers you're going to need it all to get your properties done. So, start out with a 6x12. Six, six I'd advise a 6.5. That way you can have enough room to turn them sideways if you need to. And, and that just really helps. Like, say you got mulch on the front of the trailer. Put a mower in sideways and you're fine. But, I, I've had to do that a couple times. So, it, it's not out of the ordinary. You're always having stuff on your trailer. So, I hope this video, I, I just strongly advise starting with the 12-foot trailer. That way you can grow into it a little bit. And then a 16-footer, grow into it some more. And then add more trailers down the road. It's all about growth and all about growing your business. So let me know what you think of the video. Let me know what you think of Lawn Bros. Welcome to the family. I'm going to start calling you Lawn Bros unless there's some people say they don't like being called Lawn Bros. But go ahead, welcome to the family. And... Please subscribe, hit that subscribe button because we hit a thousand subs on YouTube last week. So we're always growing 
hit the subscribe button, and we'll see you guys on Sunday in the next video. We're always posting Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Sunday, four times a week. So be ready for all the videos coming out. Go p back and watch some videos that you missed. Hit the subscribe button so you're always up to date.